okay um this is just a little gameplay or a little video to show that um, that you can pl uh, play um, iphone games with a ps3 control right here oh. right here with this control so uh, i have now downloaded uh, an app from studio called uh, called blue, uh, blue troll uh, which makes um, which makes you able to play uh, uh, iPhone games with a PS3 control. So I have just now mapped my uh, PS3 controller to work with uh, with the iPhone. So the things you need, uh, you need uh, first you need to have a jailbroken iPhone, iPad, or iPod uh, to be able to uh, um, to make this work. And if uh, we'll find those in Syria, I will add uh, add that in the. Uh, uh, as a caption later so um, the, f the first thing you want to get um, uh, to get the ps3 control to work with uh, um, to work with the iPhone is uh, a program called 6 uh, axis uh, pair tool which uh, which basically is a little con a little software that makes you able to uh, to reconfigure the control to um, uh, to make you manual uh, that makes you uh, able to manually reconfigure the uh, Bluetooth uh, address that the control uses. So here I have set the Bluetooth uh, address for my iPhone, which uh, which you see the current master, which is the master uh, master address for for the control, which uh, which you also will find in the uh, in the general settings and the about part. I'll show you. Um, I'm sorry if I uh, kind of act weird in this video, but I do not uh, do reviews and such uh, often. So yeah, so um, you want to go to general. Oops. Uh, yeah, you want to go to ge uh, general about and go uh, uh, go um, all uh, almost all the way down to see the Bluetooth part there, and then you can see my address. So there. Um, yeah, so you need to pay, you need to paste that address um, in the little uh, box there, and then uh, and then uh, press update. So yeah, so the other programs you needed uh, was uh, uh, Blue Troll, which um, which makes you able to add games, and then uh, um, which makes you able to add games, and then. Uh, map the controls for uh, for each game like this one if I then <coughs> go to add and for for example uh, go to um, um, they didn't have it there but uh, for the ps3 controller for example then you can see that I I have mapped every yeah. hmm. ah, there we go there you can see that I have added uh, all, most of the PS3 controllers to to each of its destinations so that uh, it matches to uh, the controls that uh, PlayStation 3 games uh, would normally have. But uh, I have changed the um, R2 and L2 for aiming and shooting, like uh, it is on Xbox. So yeah, so uh, the way uh, so. Um, um, the way you have to do to add the uh, PS3 controller is to uh, add the address at a, as I said earlier, but also to to activate the uh, Bluetooth stack, which is uh, um, which is the uh, app that you get in Syria. So when you go into BT stack, you wanna activate the uh, BT stack menu uh, from here, and then um, when you are done that, you just wait um, until it's finished. Um, wait a second. Uh, wait until it's finished up in the corner, and when when it's ready, <coughs> you then go into um, into a beat roll, and then you will go to the controller, and then you you will you will see that um, that you get, for example, PS3 controller, then you press connect. And then waiting for the PS3 control, and then um, you need to disconnect it from the 
uh, from the cable of course and then uh, just pl uh, press the button and it auto automatically maps or connects to the iPhone so it's ready for use so yeah so when you have mapped um, uh, map the game you want to add and um, and um, have everything ready you then just go right into into the game which is uh, in my case uh, Modern Combat 4 you can then enjoy playing with a PlayStation 3 controller let's see ah, kind of a small menu um, ah there we go let's see. so then you can enjoy playing almost um, FPS games like on like on your PlayStation 4 right on your iPhone when you're on the bus on the travel or whatever yeah so uh, yeah so enjoy the little gameplay here <laughs> And yeah, I forgot to mention that um, it doesn't spin all the way around when you look around. It only um, uh, ends the uh, lo look around in the corners uh, and such. So you have to you have to um, do it several times to be able to look all uh, all the way through. So um, it's not uh, it's not so good. Um, for uh, FPS games, but uh, it definitely w will be good for uh, uh, for your uh, RPG games that uh, is not uh, first-person shooters, but rather uh, third-person. So yeah, uh, I hope you like it, cause uh, I'm not doing this so very often, but I thought it would uh, would be fun to uh, to try to make a little tutorial. Even though I suck at it, <laughs> so yeah. Um, so um, write in the comments if you have any questions or I just wanna, um, yeah. Let's see. Um, So yeah, this is what I was a little, little uh, gameplay uh, and show off to show how how well the PlayStation 3 controller can actually be used to to play games on uh, first person games or any games on uh, on the iPhone. And this is iPhone 564 gig uh, model. So yeah, thank you for watching and uh, um, I just. Uh, ask in the comment section if you have any questions or such. Thank you for watching.